everyone. Welcome to Busy Lizzie's Budget. Thank you so much for being here with me today. I'm excited to bring you a video where I show to you all of the savings challenges I'm going to be using for my Christmas binder. Now, I have not made my Christmas binder yet because first I wanted to show you the mail that I got that I'm going to use to put into making the binder. So before I mix all this up and cut things and punch things and put them in binders, I wanted to make sure that I showed you where each of the challenges came from because they were all gifts to me. So I'm gonna be filming this video on two different days. So I'll have probably a different shirt sleeves on and I'll have different nails probably, but I had to do it on two different days because I can't start making the binder until I show you all these lovely things. So let's go ahead and get right into it. As I'm taking these things out, I just wanted to say, I had this idea in December. It was a really hard month for me financially because I get paid once a month and we, and so I had, and there were five weeks that I had to five weeks that I had to account for. And it was Christmas and things like that, so things were a little more expensive. So anyway, I had this idea. Why don't I reach out to other YouTubers who have Etsy shops, and some of them I knew and I've purchased from before, others I didn't, but I just found some scratch-off savings challenges that were Christmassy or wintry that I want to use for saving up for Christmas of 2023. So I decided to go ahead and just ask them nicely if they'd be willing to give these to me. And then I will use them on my channel and link their shops when I do and things like that. So anyway, everyone was super kind. Everyone said yes. I couldn't believe it. A lot of people sent me freebies, like even more freebies, extra things, and they pay for postage. And I just wanna say a huge thanks to everyone in this video who I mentioned because you all totally, totally blew me away. And now I'm able to make this binder without purchasing any of these, these scratch off savings challenges. So it definitely saved me over $100 just in the things I asked for, not including all the freebies I got sent. So I know you're saying, we don't wanna see your hands. Start putting the first challenge there. We wanna see what you got. So let me do that. So I just wanna shout out to these people. This one is from the Thrifty Sewist and she was kind enough to send me these two snowy savings and i wanted to have mini ones or smaller amounts because i wanted to have as many different scratch ups as i could in this binder so i chose two that she had one was fifty dollars and one is 150 so that is super cool and i'm excited to use those the next all the rest of these have notes and things so i'll, I'll just i took them out of the envelopes but i'll show you um, the notes. So this one says, Elizabeth, thank you for supporting my business. I hope you enjoy this scratch off cat. So this is from Katrina and I believe you all know her or a lot of you will know her. Um, it's cat and moon budgets and she has an awesome channel and she sent me these two scratch offs that I had asked for. And I'll try to go through all of this quickly. Um, but I definitely just wanted to give a lot of thanks to the people who sent me these. Um, so here's a Christmas scratch off and this says naughty or nice savings. And I don't know the exact amounts. I have them written down somewhere, but I just wrote them down because I wanted to make sure to ask people um, what the amounts were because I only wanted to do smaller ones and I wanted to make sure that all of the ones that I put in this binder equal the amount I need to save for Christmas. But I love it how she put these on this decorative scrapbook paper. They're super pretty. So anyway, I'll go ahead and put those to the side and take out the next one. And again, I'll try to go through these quickly so it's not a super long video. This is from Sam's Crafts and Customs. And let's see, I asked for this. It's already punched for A6, which is awesome. So it's for saving 300. I think it's super cute. And um, <clears throat> I couldn't believe it when she sent this too and it's a tracker that you can reuse for the bank, a cash breakdown, I guess you'd call it. I do use use these, but I don't have a reusable one like this. And she put my name on it. And I was just blown away because again, I would she sent me this as a freebie. I didn't even pay for it. And I couldn't believe she did this for me. So I thought that was super sweet. So I also just want you guys to know about these shops so that if you're wondering 
um, who, who you can support in the next year. I highly recommend all of these shops that I'm listing in this video. This is from, I'm not sure how to pronounce all these, but Andy Fiore, and it says, best of luck with your channel, and thank you, Elizabeth. And this is from, I think it's Maisha. So that was really nice, and I picked this $300 Grinch Savings. I'm probably gonna say, keep saying, I thought it was super cute, but I really thought these were all super cute. And there was an envelope in here. It's not punched, so I'm not sure how many use it, but I will figure it out. That's where my creative side will come out. So that was really nice. And um, I just can't believe these people, you guys all are the sweetest and I'm just so grateful. This next one is from Cindy at Cindy Cat Budgets. I may have pronounced that wrong. If I did, I'm sorry. Hi, Liz. I hope you enjoy using this script these scratch offs next year. Have a wonderful holiday, Cindy. And these are two scratch offs for Christmas. One's $100 and this one is $350. And then she included trackers for these and they're beautiful. The corners are rounded and everything like that. So that was super exciting. I can't wait to put all of these into a binder and show it to you all. This one Sorry, I put some notes so I'd remember who they're from if it didn't say. This one is from Amber, and the name of her shop is Hold My Money. And she sent me this. I guess I'll take it out of here now, but I had to show you how nicely it came wrapped. And let's see. This is just the scratch off that I asked for. It's $125, it says winter fun. And she sent me a $100 placeholder with a beautiful rainbow sticker that I absolutely love. So that was a really nice surprise. I was not expecting that. And then the next one, there's still more guys. I'm telling you, I cannot believe how many people treated me to these things for Christmas. This is from hands and bands. And let me just tell you, I was blown away when I received this. So basically, oh, I ordered this. <laughs> this wasn't a freebie. I ordered this for um, a challenge I had bought, the Larry envelope, but I accidentally ordered the wrong size. So I had to reorder a smaller one. So that was something I purchased. But this is the one that she sent me for free, this scratch off. And I'm telling you guys, there's so much stuff in here. There's this beautiful $100 colorful placeholder, which I've been eyeing on everyone's channels and I really wanted one. So now I feel special. And she sent that for free. And then someone just had this in a video. I think it was Tracy. It could have been Liz, but I think it was Tracy. And when I saw that, I said to Matt, I was like, oh, that's so colorful. And it comes with the stickers to put on it. Like, And I said, I want that. I have to have that. And I was going to buy it. And then before I bought it, it showed up as a freebie. So just wanted to say, and I believe this is Alicia. I'm sorry, there's so many people here and so many names. And um, you know what? I didn't even see this before. I'll read it with you. It says, Elizabeth, thank you for your order. I hope you have fun with your savings challenges in 2023, hands and bands. Okay, so my order was for that envelope. But anyway, um, so I'm so excited because I am definitely gonna do the other challenge that she sent as well. So that'll be really exciting. Moving right along, I had to show you this bubble, bubble mailer because or it's bubble wrap, but it has butterflies on it. It's so cute, guys. I just had to save that to show you. So this is from the Philip Sisters. And there's a cute little thank you card and they wrote this handwritten note. Thank you for reaching out to us, Elizabeth. Hope you enjoy. We sent a few of our other scratch cards for you to try out as well. Heart, Jenny, and Leslie. So I had asked for this Christmas one that's $100 with these little snowmen. And they sent me these other two challenges for free, guys. So $150 and $300. So that was really surprising, really exciting. And I'm so thankful for them. And we've got a couple more left. Actually, I think I will leave it in this. Um, I won't take it out of the plastic because it'll take a while, but I think you can you can tell what it is. This is from Gentle Charms, and this is from Heather. Heather sent me this tree. It's so gorgeous. It's, it actually might be Gentle Charm Budgets, but like I said, every everybody 
will be linked in the description box. If they have a, a YouTube channel in addition to their Etsy shop, they'll both be listed together, so you'll know. So you'll definitely wanna check everyone out, but this is this beautiful tree and presents, and it all comes to $500. So thank you to Heather. And then let's see, we have, this is from Janelle Ray Budgets. And again, I'm not gonna take it out. I hope you can see it though. Um, but it is a $300 scratch off challenge. And what I love is that there are tons of things to scratch, but it only comes out to 300. So hopefully these will be some smaller amounts. So thank you, Janelle. And then lastly, I already posted a video, so hopefully you saw it, but Star Budgets or Kim from Star Budgets, I had asked her for the Snow Globe, the Snow Globe scratch off, which I didn't know it came with this envelope. So that was a nice surprise. So you'll see this envelope in the binder. And then I had asked her for these three mystery savings. And, oh, I sure did, before asking her for them, I sure did send her a private message asking her what the amounts were because I needed to make sure they were small enough amounts. And they were. So these are the three I'll be doing for Chris in my Christmas binder as well as the Snow Globe Challenge. And if you didn't catch that video, it's actually um, going to be a bonus video coming out tomorrow but this video won't be going out for a while. So that video will definitely be up, but I do a video where um, dedicated to opening Star's package because there were so many things in it and I wanted to do a giveaway with some of the extras. So anyway, that is everything for this part of the video. Those are all of the things I received in the mail for free. I'm telling you, these people are so, so nice. I really recommend that you follow their shops, check out their YouTube channels, go support them. They're awesome people. And I will say goodbye for now. And then eventually I will make the Christmas binder and come back and show it to you in the next clip. So thanks for watching. I'll see you in a bit. Hello everyone, I'm back. This is probably a couple weeks later. Today is January 12th, 12th I believe, however you say that. And it's a Thursday. And I just went out in a snowstorm to McDonald's to buy fountain soda, to buy a Coke. And my daughter's homesick and I got her a small one. So obviously caffeine's an addiction if I went out in a snowstorm because yeah, it took a long time to get the snow off the car, warm up the car, drive there, drive back. And I have to go out in another hour to get my son. So yeah, anyway. I'm back to show you, I just made the Christmas binder yesterday. I did it all yesterday. Before I show you, I just wanna ask you one question. The clip you just saw a moment ago, it was from a while ago before I had my new setup. So right now I'm using my microphone and my lights. So let me know if you see a difference in either thing and if it's better now with the lights and the microphone. Okay, so you guys have been waiting for it. Here it is. Here is the binder that I made. And I realize that there are so many things inside here, it barely closes. So I may need to go to Walmart and buy the rings and just use rings and not use this binder. But I did buy a binder, a PVC binder with the white. And if I have to take, like I said, this off, that's fine. I made a cover, a front cover and a back cover. And since I'm gonna be using this all year to fill this up, I didn't wanna get sick of seeing Christmas colors. So I did this light coral color and it kind of matched the sticker. So here we go. I'm gonna walk you through this. I'm super excited about it. I did do another Friends reference. The ones where, the one where we use scratch offs to save for Christmas 2023. So you guys just saw everything I was putting in here and who it was from. So I'm, and I have stickers all over here all over the place on every single thing saying where these came from so you guys can see easily and so that you won't forget, I won't forget if anyone else wants to purchase these. And obviously everyone will be linked in my description box, both their channel and their Etsy shop if they have both. So let's just go through it. So, oh, I forgot these, oh, hang on one second. I forgot I need to get these um, ones that, these larger ones that aren't in here. Sorry about that, okay. So this is the first one in the binder. It's the scratch off from Star Budgets and the Snow Globe one. And here is the envelope for that. She had already provided one. Actually, let me move this over so I can just put both things out. Oh, look at that. Okay, let's go with that. So that is the first one. 
The second one, and I don't know if it would be easier to see with a piece of paper behind it because you can kind of see through it, but um, I'm not really sure. But anyway, this one I just wrote ho, ho, ho. This is from Janelle Ray Budgets and it's it said ho, ho, ho there. So I decided to go with that. So I have these, this loft sticker and because it talked kind of about something Santa would say, I put the cookies for Santa there. And then the next one is, thought it was below there, but I guess I didn't grab all three sheets. Sorry about that. Here is the next one. It is the Christmas tree scratch and save and from Gentle Charms from Heather, I believe. And I, I had actually gotten the sticker for free. It was actually a freebie and something that I ordered. It was probably sloth Christmas stickers I ordered or something Christmassy and I received that sticker. It's like the little Debbies. I thought it was so cute and it was appropriate for this one. And then once I have money inside these, you'll be able to see them more easily. But anyway, those were the three that had the larger sheets of paper. And then I already showed these to you, so I'm not gonna keep flipping this back and forth because I really just wanna show you the envelopes I made to go with these. And I don't want this video to be super, super long and I can't remember how long the other clip is. So anyway, these are um, the Naughty and Nice Savings, the two from Cat, from Cat over Cat and Moon Budgets. So those two are there and here is the envelope I made to go along with that. And again, I'm just gonna go along really quickly. These are from Wendy, the Thrifty Sewist, and I have two scratch offs from her. And here is the envelope I made to go along with that. It's funny, I just had some, I just ordered a small pack of Sloth Christmas stickers and I ended up just having enough along with two other stickers I used. So anyway, that was pretty cool. I love this one right here. It's very unique. And here is the envelope from Sam's Crafts and Customs. I can't wait to start using these. In case you guys are wondering, I'm gonna, this, I am gonna be using this all year long until it's filled up and I can start shopping, but I'm not gonna bring, bring this out and start using it until my dental debt is paid off. Once my dental debt is paid off, I will start using this in my probably my weekly savings challenge videos. So again, these are upside down, but these are another two cute ones from Cindy. There's envelope for that. I don't know if there's gonna be a glare or not, so I'm just kind of moving these around a little bit for you to see. And then, let's see. Here's the next one from Alicia at Hands and Bands. I love this sticker. It's, I mean, come on, they're all just so cute. I'm actually super excited for Ange and Stacy, or should I say Stracy, to see this video with all my sloths in here. I know they'll really like it. And I think Rebecca might have told me she likes sloths too. I don't think she has it as bad as the rest of us do, but anyway. So these are three more from Kim over at Star Budgets. So we have two envelopes for her. Here's the one I made. And we'll just keep moving right along. This scratch off is from Hold My Money. And there is the envelope that goes with it. And then sadly, you'll see on a lot of these, I had to chop stuff off to make it fit. So. This one, I had to cut off the Grinch and the Christmas hat on the Grinch and things like that. So it's not as colorful and pretty, but I still love it. And this is from the Andy Fiore collection. And then they included this envelope and I really liked it and wanted to use it. So I just added this sticker and I added some green paper. Um, it secured really well and I punched it. So that way I could use their envelope and then this is actually one of my favorite stickers. I had an extra one. I've already used it on something else, but I put the sticker here because it goes along with the winter theme and I'm just obsessed with that beanie sticker. And then the last one is, I think this is the last one is here and it's from the Phillips sisters in Canada. And I used, um, this envelope is actually from Savannah over at Sav Saves. Um, I had bought this a long time ago. Of course, when I saw it, I had to have it. So. She had sent that to me, so that is from her, but I decided to use it for this, and I put another little Christmas sticker on the back of it. So the only thing I have to do is show you the back cover, and then we'll be all done. 
So this is what I put on the back. And again, I feel like this was a freebie that was sent to me. I could be wrong, but I think it was. So anyway, I just used everything I had on hand. I really wanted to put some yellow envelopes in here because that's kind of Christmassy, but literally I just went with what I had. I had two different shades of green, but I didn't want to go out and spend money. So literally I just whipped this all up between last night and this morning. And now, I need to take my cute little thank you notes and send everybody thank you notes because I just want to remind you one more time that these all came as gifts. I asked if they would give them to me to use for my binder and we could help each other out. So check out all of these shops and these wonderful people. And I hope you liked this video and I'll see you again soon. Thank you so, so much for watching. I appreciate you. Have a great day. Bye.